Usemi wa Rais Uhuru Kenyatta wa Jumatano Juma lilopita akiwa kaunti ya Nakuru huenda ulizidisha masaibu yanazozikumba serikali za kaunti kutokana na swala nyeti la mgao unaofaa kuelekezwa kwenye serikali hizo kutokana na pato la kitaifa Let us take what we have ikiongezeka tutaongeza lakini jameni let us just take what we have what are we arguing about because kama ingekuweko situngewapatia Mwanasheria mkuu Paul Kihara Siku ya Ijumaa naye akatoa mwongozo wa kisheria na kumuonya kaimu waziri wa fedha ukuru ya tani dhidi ya kutoa nusu ya mgao wa shilingi bilioni na kumi kama alivyokuwa amekisia kwa kusema kuwa itakuwa ni kinyume cha sheria kwa kiasi cha shilingi bilioni tano kutolewa wakati sheria haipo. Devolution is not on its deathbed. Devolution is only undergoing its own challenges and the unique things. There are areas and counties where devolution has functionally been useful there are areas and counties where you can see the effect of devolution hapa kukiwa na uamuzi wa mahakama ya upeo ambayo iliamuru bunge la kitaifa na lile la seneti kuzamia mwafaka wa kutanzua kitendawili hiki na kusema iwapo itashindikana basi tarehe 16 mwezi septemba ndio itatoa uamuzi wake hili likiashiria kuwa serikali za kaunti hazitakuwa na fedha mwezi wa Julai Agosti na vile vile Septemba kwenye muktadha huu so with the stand of that exists it's a natural consequence could be that uh, the the devolution uh, functions will be uh, frustrated hapa kukiwa na kamati ya upatanisho ambayo hadi wa leo baada ya kubuniwa hajitangaza siku ya kikao cha kwanza huku mabunge yote yakiwa likizoni hadi juma la kwanza la mwezi septemba kumaanisha kuwa iwapo kamati ya upatanisho haitafikiana basi ni sharti maspika kuitisha vikao maalum la sivyo msukosuko huu huenda ukaendelea hadi mwezi wa Oktoba. Why don't we approve this bill? Mulete pesa hapa watu walipo mishara yao dawa ipelekwe kwa mahospitali wananchi waweze kuendelea na maisha yao. Why are we punishing them? Because we are arguing that we want more. This is only a setback in terms of the functions and powers of the two houses of parliament with regard to safeguarding devolution. This is a question where a government still is struggling to have the last aspects of the power that they want to retain. They feel that they should have a very powerful national assembly that should not be checked, that they should have an executive that makes the decisions with regard to devolution without checks and balances. Isijulikane basi wapo ni kimaksudi na ni ubabe ambao unazidi kuzingira swala hili huku utoaji huduma na mishahara ya fanyikazi kwenye serikali za county ukizidi kuwa kama usiku wagiza andas ihachi k24 weekendi